anytime you have two variables on a graph review plot with two different dimensions, you'll find that it's convenient to use a second axis. In this example circuit, I'm looking at the voltage and power associated with that resistor over the source voltage ranging from zero to 10 volts. Now the trouble here is that since both of them are plotted on the same axis, but we really have two different dimensions, we're not seeing anything going on with power. Let me create a right axis. I'll give this its own label of power and resistor two in units of watts. Then I'll enable that axis and then come back to the trace ID and then select the variable that I want to plot on the right axis. So I'll then direct that one to the right axis, come back here, hit the auto range button to see what we've got. Now I notice the range has been cut down dramatically. And here we have a nice second axis corresponding to the power trace and the voltage is on the left side. I'm gonna go ahead and correct the label here. So I right click and select axis properties, type in a new label for the left axis. I'm gonna go ahead and take care of the bottom axis while I'm at it. Actually for left axis, I wanted to call that the voltage associated with resistor two. Bottom axis is my source voltage. All right, that all looks good for the labeling. Perhaps last of all, uh, let's take care of changing the plot title to something that perhaps matches what you're trying to do. I can get at this from the general tab. All right, there you have it. Pretty straightforward.